Let us see how to draw the diagram of human excretory system in easy steps. Let us see the structure and functioning of different parts of the human excretory system. Kidneys Humans have a pair of kidneys. They are in the shape of bean seeds. Right kidney is a bit lower than the position of the left kidney. The length of a kidney is 10 cm, width 5 to 6 cm and thickness is about 4 cm. Its outer surface is convex in shape and the inner surface is concave. The center depression on the concave side of the kidney is called hilus. Dorsal Iota this large artery brings oxygenated blood with impurities to kidneys. It divides into renal arteries near the kidneys. Renal artery Oxygenated blood with nitrogenous wastes enter into the kidneys through these renal arteries. Renal arteries enter the kidney at the hilus region. Posterior vena cava. This is a large vein that collects the blood from kidneys and carries it to the heart. Renal vein. These veins collect the filtered blood and transports it into the posterior vena cava. Vena cava. 
ureters. They begin from the hilus region and reaches the urinary bladder. They carry the urine formed in the kidney to the urinary bladder. The urine moves in the ureter with the help of peristaltic movements. Each ureter is about 30 cm long. Urinary bladder. This is a thin-walled bag-like structure. It can store up to 800 ml of urine. Urethra. This is a duct that passes the urine out. There is a sphincter muscle between urinary bladder and urethra. It controls the outflow of urine. It is 4 cm long in women and 20 cm long in males. In males, urethra is also called as urinogenital duct. Thanks for watching. Please like the video. Please share this video with your friends. Please subscribe to Great Booster channel. Press the bell icon to get all the latest updates. Check the description to find links of other useful videos. Check the end screens for our new videos.